to a thousand subscribers, I will be doing a giveaway, a Jordan or Nike Dunk giveaway. I will be giving away a free shoe. Heck, it could be a Panda Dunk, you guys. So make sure you follow me to help me get to a thousand subs so we can do a free shoe giveaway. We don't know what shoe. It could be a Panda Dunk. could be a Jordan. We don't know. So stay tuned. Welcome to the channel. It's your boy, Sneak T. Today, I'm going to show you guys a few sneakers that I've been able to pick up with the market being really low, all at retail, from retailers too. I know some of these shoes that you'll be able to find on Gold or StockX below retail, you know, which is cool and everything, but sometimes you just wanna cop it from like Nike, from Sneakers app, from Foot Locker, you know, you just feel more secure, at least with the fakes, I feel like right now at an all time high, reps are at an all time high. If you wear reps, you know, do you, but my thing with refs is it floods the market. It's counterfeiting. I have a whole nother topic. I could do a part two on my opinion on reps and how they affect the sneaker community. Check out that video that I did that on a while back, you guys. Still some valid points, you know, but anyways, today I'm gonna show you guys some shoes that I've been able to pick up for retail. So the first shoe I'll start off, I'll just show you. I got the whole family running these. This is for my wife and this was for my son. And this is a Jordan 1, as you can tell by the grade school box. And I was able to pick these up for retail, man. These are probably still sitting in a lot of sizes for retail. And I think it's a dope shoe, and I have it myself. I did a video on it, and that shoe is the Jordan 1 Heritage, you guys. I got a toddler size 10C right here. I have a grade school size 6.5 right here. Um, I got these both off of the Nike app. Not sneakers, Nike apps. Some, some shoes you can get off of both. They actually have these loaded on the Nike app. So I was able to cop both of these for the whole family run. I was able to cop mine for retail as well. One set from JD Sports and then I got theirs too from Nike. So the whole family running these. Really dope shoes that you can grab for retail, even under retail. But prices on these are, is starting to creep up, you guys, on the Heritage one. So if you guys are interested in this shoe, you want to get it for your lady, for your kids, you know. Go ahead and try to grab it because I don't know how long we're going to see the market like this. I don't know how long it's going to last. None of us do. So take advantage, you guys. Air Jordan 1 Heritage, dope shoe to get for retail right now. So moving on to the next shoe. I actually got two. They dropped in two colors. I did do a video on these, a more in-depth video on these, you guys. So if you guys want to check that video out, go ahead. But it is the off-white. I was able to cop these for retail, you guys, in the black pair. And I was also able to cop, yes, the white pair as well, you guys. So I was able to cop both pair the off-white Air Force <laughs> Ones. I know a lot of people Got probably it. aren't a fan of these because of that midsole. But, you know, some people are. And if you are, you know, you didn't, you maybe weren't you able to cop on the Nike app and you rushed to resell. Well, Sometimes you go know, you you might luck up. I was able to luck up on both of these in my size size 10 So it just shows that the market right now is at a different point right now you guys and shoes are sitting There the stocks. I don't think the stock numbers are changing too much So I just think shoes are sitting for other reasons, you know inflation There's been a lot of shoes coming out with between Adidas Nike and Jordan brand, you know, and then you got like Puma and Vans and all those other shoes so there's just so much stuff coming out that people are trying to keep up with and then the cost of living is going up so a lot of us a lot of people out here can't keep up so i think that's why a lot of shoes are really easy to cop right now like these off whites so man just take advantage of the market while you can you guys if you are investors or even if you're your collectors that's my opinion and the last shoe i want to show you guys i hope you're still watching thank you if you are still watching make sure you subscribe man Hope you guys enjoy this type of video drop a comment below if you like more videos like this more retail finds that i find you guys are for retail this shoe i was so happy to finally have in a collection man because retail on the shoe is only 100 bucks if you can tell by the box this is a nike dunk i was able to get these for retail on the restock again <laughs> if you don't already know what shoe this is i'm about to show you but i just didn't want to pay resale man i feel like they restocked this so many times the quality of the shoe isn't the greatest. I know it's gonna wear like very, very fast. So, you know, hopefully I can cop it for retail. I held out, I held out, I held out, and I copped it for retail. So sometimes you guys, you gotta be patient. If it's a shoe, I get some shoes don't drop more than once, I get it. But a common shoe like this one, what I'm about to show you, 
dropping multiple times just hold up you might be able to get them for retail and i did i secured my size a size 10 and a half and you guys this is the nike dunk low hopefully not played out but i think it is getting to that point probably a forever timeless classic you guys finally got them in the collection man i refused to pay resale for these and i didn't have to and that is the panda dunk lows you guys man i don't know probably just about every shoe collector probably has this shoe now um i guess you can throw me in that bunch now i finally grabbed my pair i hope you guys were able to cook on the restock they dropped in all sizes and the funny thing about the pandas is they drop in grade school women and men you know so and toddler and preschool so you got a full size run so for some of you people like my wife if you were like a women's eight you can go with a grade school six and a half you know so you get those two options i wasn't able to hit for her unfortunately i did hit in my size ten and a half which i was pretty stoked about so i hope you guys have been having more luck copping shoes for retail man because uh copying for retail is where it's at you guys uh no disrespect to resellers i respect resellers and all that to an extent some of them but uh yeah that's another video as well <laughs> I don't know if you, you probably have probably all seen look at the panda dunk clothes i'm not gonna go too in depth on them it is a simple dope shoe simple colorway i definitely see why these are so popular it's a black and white dunk it's just timeless it's a classic you know I'm, i don't know i'm probably gonna wear the heck out of these but it is what it is you guys thank you for watching i appreciate you guys if you've been watching this far do not forget to subscribe help me get to a thousand subscribers because at a thousand subscribers, I will be doing a giveaway, a Jordan or Nike Dunk giveaway. I haven't quite decided, but I will be giving away a free shoe. Heck, it could be a Panda Dunk, you guys. So make sure you follow me to help me get to a thousand subs so we can do a free shoe giveaway. We don't know what shoe. It could be a Panda Dunk. It could be a Jordan. We don't know. So stay tuned. Hope you guys enjoyed this Retail Cop video, and I'll see you guys next time. Stay positive.